Hi everyone, welcome to YouTube channel and today we are going to see how to fix BlueStacks additional update record stuck or not downloading. So before getting into the video, make sure you have hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss upcoming videos. Is your application stuck on additional update record message and unable to download the application? Then this video will help you to uh, fix the error and the reason behind it. So the error message additional update record means this is application needed to install install BlueStacks on your machine. The other reasons are you might have sufficient insufficient memory to install the update in your uh, instances, which will may not be enabled issue with the application inside the BlueStack application. Make sure the software is BlueStacks 5, not BlueStacks 6. Before getting into the solution, click on the update button on the screen. Wait until the download and installation complete. If the screen is stuck on the downloading, follow the below the troubleshooting steps. Check your internet connection. You need to check your internet connection and speed. If you find any internet issue, do the following steps to regain your internet connection. Power off and power on your mobile data or the Wi-Fi. If you are using mobile data, switch to the Wi-Fi or vice versa. Unplug and replug the internet cable in Wi-Fi router. If the internet still has the issue, Restarting the router will fix the issue. If you have a good internet connection, the BlueStack app still faces the problem. Clear the temp file. If you have a good internet connection, close all the applications and restart your PC. Close the application and shut down the application properly. Wait 2 minutes and power on your app. Now relaunch the BlueStack application and launch your game. If you have an error persist, then move to the next step. Update the application via Google Play. If an app is stuck on downloading screen, then try downloading the application from Google Play. Open your BlueStack software and go to the Play Store. Please search for your application download it. Now launch your game on BlueStacks and check if the issue is gone. Many you said reported that downloading the application from Play Store works fine. Solution number 4. Check Hyper-V status on your PC. Search for the turn windows or features on or off and click it on the search list. Scroll down and check whether the below steps are enabled. Hyper-V virtual machine platform, Windows hypervisor platform, Windows sandbox, Windows subsystem for Linux. If not enabled, enable it now and restart your PC. The next solution number 5, clearing the temp and app files. Deleting app data and temp files will remove any glitches or corrupted histories in the system will help you to create fresh new cache data when launching your instance. Please follow the instructions to remove your temp file. But don't worry if some won't delete. <coughs> type run in the Windows search bar to open the run command box. Type percentage temp percentage in the run input field and set all the files in the open folder. Press shift, plus delete, press shift plus delete to delete all the files from the temp file. Again, run the, open the run application and input percentage app data percentage. Find and locate the BlueStack folder and delete it. Likewise, run the command percentage local app data percentage and find and locate the BlueStack folder and delete it. Go to the desktop and empty your recycle bin. Also delete unused applications or installations if you have any. Repeat your PC and try launching your game application on your BlueStack. If the error persists, then check the RAM allocation in BlueStacks. Increase RAM and disk space. Your BlueStack application might lack RAM or, or the some other applications consume more RAM. First try installing the game application by closing all other applications tags. Is launch the game and see if it resolves the downloading issue. Yes, increase the RAM and disk space. Launch the BlueStacks application and click on settings in the sidebar. Click on the performance tab and where you will see the memory allocation and CPU uh, allocation uh, option where increase the 1 GB or 1 CPU core from the current allocation numbers by selecting the custom option. Close your BlueStacks application and relaunch it. Try creating the new instance and check it if the error is gone. Reinstall the BlueStacks application. If nothing above monitor works then you, there is no issue with the memory. You need to reinstall the BlueStacks application. Try add a remove program in the Windows search bar and click on it from the search list. The program and application management setting page opens where Find the BlueStack and right click on it to uninstall the BlueStacks application. Repeat the fifth method to delete temp and app data files. After doing this, please reboot to your PC, then download and install our latest version from here. If you click on the link, you will redirect to the BlueStack official website where you can download the latest version of BlueStacks. Make sure you have the recommended system configuration to install the latest version. After the installation, you can launch your BlueStack application and launch your instance without any errors. I hope you found this video useful. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button 
and subscribe to our channel for more such videos thank you